Hello, in this video we're going to look at Monopoly and we're going to look at the standard graphical analysis of Monopoly. So here we have a Monopoly firm. The Monopolist demand curve slopes downward. The Monopoly faces the entire market demand curve which slopes downwards. The marginal revenue curve for the Monopoly will be twice as steep as demand. So if the demand curve is touching here the quantity axis at 20, the marginal revenue will touch at one half that distance, or in this case, 10. The monopolist has marginal cost curve here and an average total cost curve. First thing we want to find is where does the monopolist produce? What is its profit maximizing output? The monopolist will produce where marginal cost equals marginal revenue. So we find that intersection here where MC equals MR. We come down to the quantity axis and that's six. Six represents the profit maximizing output. The next step is we want to find the profit maximizing price. To do that, take the 6 and walk it all the way up vertically till it touches the demand curve. And we come across and we see the profit maximizing price is $28. The next step is to get total revenue. Total revenue is the price times quantity. So we're going to take $28 and multiply it by 6. So this monopolist has total revenue of $168. The next step is to find some information out about cost. At six units of output, we're going to take that and we're going to plug it into the average total cost equation, or average total cost curve. So take this six, move it up vertically until we touch average total cost, come across, and we see that the per unit cost of production is $24. The next step is to get total cost. Total cost is average total cost times quantity. So 24 times 6 gives this firm a total cost of $144. The next step is to get the firm's profit. Profit is total revenue minus total cost. So a $168 minus $144 leaves this firm with a profit of $24. We can visualize that profit of $24 as the area of this rectangle, the difference between price and average total cost up to that last unit sold, the sixth unit. That is a four by six rectangle, and that represents the firm's profit. Okay, I hope you found this video helpful.